Located just on the edge of downtown Acton, Prospect Park has been a popular place of recreation for over a century. Prospect Park was originally planned to be divided into lots and built into a housing development when it was owned by Ransom Adams. Thankfully, that never came to be as the village of Acton purchased it in 1886. The name Prospect may have derived from the fact that it was once prospective land for potential real estate or because it was a prospect, like a jewel, due to its natural beauty. Although never confirmed, these are the theories that are often speculated to be plausible. The lake that surrounds the park was created in the early 1830s by damming up the Black Creek to power the flour mill. The lake was known for many years as the Mill Pond or Fish Pond until it received the name Fairy Lake in 1872, which was named by local merchant Mrs. Augusta Secord. For a little more than a century, the Beardmore Tannery owned the lake until the deed was given to the town of Halton Hills in 1989. Shortly after the park's creation, it became a popular place for recreational activities such as picnics, sports, swimming, and boating. It also became a place of gathering for events such as Canada Day and the Acton Fall Fair. Located in the park includes historic structures and points of interest such as the drill shed, the old band shell and gates, and the Pioneer Cemetery. Other structures include a playground, splash pad, boathouse, the rotary band shell, a water treatment plant, and the Dufferin Community Center. The Dufferin Center, built in 2007, was once the location of the Acton Arena from 1929 until its demolition in 1998, when it was replaced by the new arena located on the east side of Acton on Queen Street. It is also to note that the splash pad built in 2010 replaced the kiddie pool that opened in 1953. Today, Prospect Park continues to be enjoyed by many as a place of sport and recreation.